basically for the start of this project and like what inspired me, I used to live in Chiang Mai for three years before coming back to Bangkok. And my family and I decided to do online learning in Chiang Mai um, this year. And I reconnected with One Part Foundation in Chiang Mai and have been working with them ever since summer break. And at first I helped tutor the kids English and helped with them easing into the familiarity of using English. But, um, and Baimon joined in, um, to Chiang Mai. She came for a trip to visit us in Chiang Mai and she also helped tutor the kids. After talking with the children there, um, we engaged in many conversations about likes, dislikes, and wants. I wanted to help them um, achieve like more in English and also in what they want. So my in first initial idea was to kind of create like a club or something to where like there are volunteers to help tutor the kids English. But I guess there wasn't enough participants and it wasn't working as planned and I wanted to do something better. So I incorporated that idea with my new idea in um, the Wishing Star program. I also helped Sandy with creating the website and also like the layout and the stars. But I just thought like, you know, with the wishing star, because that's the name that I thought, because at my old school in Chiang Mai, every year we also did kind of a fundraiser too. So this kind of inspired me. Like I enjoyed helping the kids when I was younger and, you know, going to the foundations and hold, hosting fundraisers. And one of the fundraisers that I hosted was for Warm Heart Foundation. And I just thought of like, you know, the wishing star name as it's almost Christmas and, you know, they're wishing for something. So the wishing star. And I thought, wouldn't it be cool if like, because I was going to make it, I was planning to make it a website, if people could click on, you know, stars and it would link us to like um, the children's profile. And I asked Baimon if it was possible and through like a long plan, she was able to do it. And it was kind of tough, but she pulled it off because she's amazing. Well, for me, I think it's like creating the website <clears throat> and like knowing like for the layout. And I also learned some new things like how to create the stars and that would take you to the kids. And I also think like I developed on time management because we didn't really know how long it would take to create the website. So we basically had to like estimate it and plan it. For the skills that I've learned, um, like Baimon mentioned, I definitely learned um, website building skills. And I think communication and like marketing was also a very big factor because we had to, we're still trying to advertise our Wishing Star program and make sure that it reaches the bigger community and everybody's notified. But I think the biggest core factor that I've learned is empathy and namjai, which is one of Verso's um, core to in their DNA. Well, my friends have been really supportive as um, Baimon has helped me a lot. And also I would like to mention my friend Lily. She was like, when I told her about this idea, she was ready to like support me and I would really like to thank her and the learning designers for this. Well, our long-term goal is to build kind of like a club and like many organizations that will hopefully connect Verso with One Heart Foundation and I would like to initiate a group of volunteers who would like to be part of this, kind of like um, mangrove teens. And I would also like this to be ongoing for next year too. And throughout the year, I would like to host more fundraisers for them.
Well, if you would like to sponsor a child, you can visit my website and fill in the form. You can read through the children's bio and what they want. Or if you prefer to be kind of hands-on and more action, you could sign up to help um, tutor the kids. Ultimately, I would like to thank everybody who has shown their support. And I wanted this like project as part of this project, not, our, not only are we demonstrating our Namja and empathy, but I also want to bring us together as a community and help work towards something.